video. I can't believe we're still doing daily videos. I can't believe we're doing daily videos still. I don't know. Like, that seems crazy. We were coming back, Abby, to change. We are coming back, Abby. Anyway, welcome to today's video. We are headed out. Actually, I know a few other people who are doing daily videos still. It's not just us. Why stop when you're enjoying something, right? Anyway, it's gorgeous outside today. It's like another spring. I can't get over it. It is gorgeous as heck out here, you guys. And I am grateful. I'm so grateful. Because any of you guys who have animals know that taking care of animals in the winter is hard as heck. Yesterday I had an apple for Penny and I was worried she wouldn't see it. Oh my goodness, she saw it from a mile away. Came right to me. She's like, do you have an apple today? I had nothing. What is a good word for someone who tries to control your life? Someone who takes over or tries to take over control of your life. Someone who thinks that they have a right to say stuff about your life. Someone who has an opinion about your life. And don't say parents <laughs> because Sylvia already said parents. I'm trying to think of a new word that would describe what we now call hater. Somebody who like thinks they have an opinion even when they're not there. Someone who thinks that they know better than you in your own life even though they're not there. Even though they're not living in your shoes. What would be a good word? Oh, easy. What? I know, what would be a good word to call them? I, I, Cause hater doesn't fit in. Because lots of times people who try, <laughs> lots of times people who try and give you advice and get upset if you don't listen, they're just trying to be helpful. So hater is not the right word. What is the word? What is the good word for that, you guys? The boss. Sam says the boss and that is a good word. Because I am the boss. <laughs> It was an idea. Parents. Parents, yeah. Well, anyways, this message is to all the people out there who think that their opinion only matters because they're smarter, know more, understand more about someone else's life. This message is for all the bosses out there. Gabby, I should ask you, what do you call someone who thinks that they get to control your life, make decisions for your life, tell you what to do because they think they know better for your life. Mom. <laughs> Spoken like a true child. Both my children said parents. <laughs> okay, so. I'd have to say wife then. <laughs> yeah, all right, so this message. It's for all the bosses out there. The only life we are the boss of is our own. And when we want to give it some advice and suggestions, that's amazing. We should always do it from the bottom of our heart and understand and recognize that the people that we love and that we're giving suggestions and ideas to have the right to do what's best for them. And under no circumstances would we ever be upset by that because we understand bosses that we are we understand that we can only understand our own life and know our own feelings and that that's okay nothing happened i just felt compelled to say that today and so i wanted to say it and i wanted to say to all of you people who are feeling bossed not to give up and just to remember that your only job to say when someone bosses you is okay thank you so much for the advice and you never have to apologize if you don't take it you never have to apologize if you don't see things the same way you just need to say thank you thank you oh thank you so much that's such good advice thank you for giving it to me and except that they except that they probably give it to you out of the goodness of their heart and don't take offense it's a two-way street every emotion is a two-way street but anyway i wanted to tell you guys that i felt compelled to tell you guys that now we're headed out uh to deal with some stuff you guys know chino lost his shoe so we're dealing with that um, not today, he can't come today, but we are dealing with that. And uh, first of all, we're gonna go shopping because it's about to get cold and we need to deal with that. All right, so we are at Costco. What's our favorite store? We're in a hurry. Yes, we're going to look at toys. This is cool, Ninja. Wow, that feels neat. I'm sorry to tell you, but this Squishmallow is in toys. Okay, let's go. So they have this igloo and they had it last year. So basically you put it in your yard and then you cover it with snow so then it doesn't collapse, but it's an igloo. Isn't it cool? I want that. 
300 bucks, but it would be fun for the grandkids. It is Christmas in Costco. Is that the kind that you like? Uh, not the beads. Not the beads that you like? Oh, neat. Here it is. So you guys know Sophie's like really into making bracelets. I like the box though. I like the box that comes in too. It's so cute. Those are all the beads. Just... Yeah, different beads. Sophie wants this Jeep. I myself would love this Batmobile. So this is what Sophie wants. She wants this giant little, my little, what's it? Hello Kitty? Uh, Hello Kitty. Giant. Hello Kitty giant Hello Kitty Swishmail. How long do you think until Daisy has that in her crate? Two minutes. Two minutes. She goes upstairs, finds all Sophie's new stuff, drags it downstairs to her crate. We I have mean, to watch her all the, the time. The other Swishmallow that I have is small. Yeah, she's safe. Alive. And some of you guys have been asking about this book. Sophie and I have been reading it oh, together. Really? Yeah, and we love it. Absolutely love it. All Hello Kitty. Yeah. All they have purple and pink. They have a mermaid. A mermaid. They have a... Whatever yeah, definitely my girl. I picked that one too. It's so cute. I also really like this. It's crayons and markers and everything you need to design. So I was thinking about getting Jacob this camera, vlogging camera, because he, you guys know, have you guys ever seen how he always says, what's up guys, when he starts talking on the vlog? Like he loves vlogging. I'm gonna ask you guys right now. Comment below, do you eat fruit cake? No. Christmas cake or no? This is my favorite food in the whole history of the world. You should close it. I am one of the weird the people that love Christmas cake. Now people can see Gabby. So remember the other day? I don't know if I vlogged about it, but I was complaining about the size of my window brush. Will you suck it up? How oh, nice. And then, who knew they made giant ones? Well, that is a man-sized brush. No such luck. Thought for sure Chino would be here. Where's your coat? Do you have a coat? Well, I, have one. I swear I see a horse in the trees. I think it's a figment of my imagination. Oh, we see. Oh, look at that. Oh, again. No food. Like I hate that. This get to stand there and watch everybody eat. That's what I hate about herds. It's not fair. But they literally could go right there and eat. The horses are not eating. They could go there and eat, but they won't go because they want to be protected in the herd. In fact, all the new horses are just standing there. Like, it's just not fair. I hate that. Horses are mean. Horses are mean. Gonna be loving on her boy. It's been a year, but I guess that's how horses work. The people at the top of the herd eat first, and then when they're done, the lower people get to eat. That's why I'm glad our horses get to come in at night because then they have their own hay and they get to eat and not have to deal with that crap. <laughs> I'm against bullying, you guys. I'm against it. Whether it's horses or dogs or any animal, whether it is just normal herd behavior or not. I love his long forelock. You look like a beach boy in the middle of winter. Yes, you do. <laughs> He's like, well, does that mean I get treats? Because that's what he wants. <laughs> Hello, handsome. When is the farrier coming? Don't worry. I had to wait until business hours to call him. You pulled your shoe on Friday night. That's not cool. If you're going to put in every time, it's on the weekend. If you're going to pull a shoe, you have to do it during the week. Okay? He's coming soon. Okay? Gonna fix your feet all the way up for you. And you'll be good, okay? We still love you. He's seriously the calmest horse, the nicest horse. Just the worst at pulling shoes. Yeah, you are, you are. He's really cute though and I really like him. Now we're headed off to the other barn to see our other horse. Every week we get to go see this stormy boy. Um, a couple of things that we bought that were interesting at Costco today was we bought these sesame snaps, a whole case of them. Nobody needs a whole case of sesame sesame snaps, but do you guys like these? I love them. It's like eating bird food, bird seed with honey, and they're so good. And then the next thing we bought, we bought a whole case of this. It was like 12 bucks. 
it's those hand warmers. You know those little hand warmer things? Let's see if I can find them. You, it's just like a little oh, package. You yeah, you rub it, you you shake it, and then you put it in your boots and your mitts, and it keeps you warm. Forty pairs. So that's like eighty of them. Forty times we can go out in the cold now. Wait, are those? The we're going to be going out on the coals way more. I know, way more. Also, Sam bought Sophie some new socks. Children's socks. Children's socks. Like little tiny girl socks instead of adult socks. I don't know why he did that. Because he doesn't read labels. I don't. But also because it says the size on here. So small, you can't even see. Alright, do we not know where the lights are? I'm on the just erase Elizabeth on Buddy. They put Elizabeth on Buddy? Alright, so there is... Much get your coat on right now. I'm not cold. Oh my gosh. There's much dismay over the board. I think what happened is that it's last week's board. I don't think Brandon's here yet and I don't think he But he swapped these two. Yeah. So Brandon took Sophie's beloved horse and gave it to yeah, um, her best I... friend. What a way to Ruin a friendship. Yeah. Just joking. So he'll ride whoever Brandon gives her. So we're the very first ones at the barn, and we think I she's hear hiding. Laughing. In here. She's hiding in here. We know I it. Hear where in the heck are the lights? Yeah. Turn on all the lights, cause we can't see. Can you guys see Gabby? Listen. What are you doing in there? <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Running in the pitch black with all these lights on, or with all these jumps. It looks pretty. <laughs> we couldn't see you because it was black. All right, so we are here in Stormy Boys Field. I think it's going in non mud. And it's dry. Oh Aw, Gabby's such oh, a doubter. Funny. Such a doubter. Daddy. She's like, oh, he won't come. Mom. It is muddy. Hi, handsome. A girl, oh my gosh, what happened? <laughs> Had his head stuck in a mud puddle. Go, go ahead, put it on him. I brought a flashlight. Here, look, I also brought you treats. Because <laughs> I love you. Yeah, this is Storm. I can't tell. Do you guys remember, oh, hold on here. Buddy's right there. Do you guys remember Julia from Barn Boots and Country Roots? Well, she is now taking lessons here and she wanted to ride storm did you want to ride storm yeah okay well you've got I, saying I wanted to ride storm oh. so badly well you got your choice all right go ahead there good boy good boy here he's like i was eating why do i have to <laughs> yeah like run run <laughs> he's a slow horse this is what he does oh god your feet are so muddy oh my gosh I don't know. I don't know about that. Sailor. So he's a cute um, pony. Is he, is he fast? Is he slow? Or is he he's big? fast and tricky. Is he the one of the sisters was riding him? No. No, I thought no. that was a... No. Okay. She was riding. All right. Like dolly or whatever that All right. Was. So, no, that wasn't Dolly. No, who should I ride? I don't want to ride Sparky. Okay, she's already ridden Spiky. Sparky. Sparky, she gets a choice. What was the other one? Sailor or... Lily. I think you should go Lily. But who's Sailor? He's go a really look short at, pony. He's a, yeah, go look at him. Here, really take my short. light. Okay, can you show me where, can, can you um, show me where he is? <laughs> so Julia's so excited to ride Storm. She said, I love Storm. And then she said, why is he licking the wall? <laughs> they all do it. Every single horse at this, like, at no this. Horse can really lick the wall unless, they like, all do it at this barn. Like, the salt on there. I think maybe they want the salt. Hi, Stormy boy. Yeah, they all lick the metal in there. I have no idea why. Hey. <laughs> Elizabeth is like still weighing her options. They went to look at the horses. The options are the opposite two that she doesn't choose. Okay. <laughs> so you get whoever she doesn't choose. So then you should ride Sailor because she's tall and Sailor's tiny. So let God decide for you. He made her taller than you. I better not die if you're riding Taylor. He hasn't been riding long. You can use the desk if you need. It's okay. Just you'll take your time, and I'll video you. So if you have a fall, no, I'm just no, joking. Then you can send it to me. Yeah, and then you can have it. Yeah. Wait, do I have to do those shirts on? No. <laughs> he 
he's retired. All right, here, take some treats. There's a bucket right there. I brought them in. Because you know how Buddy doesn't like to be caught. So Gabby's riding a new horse today. It's a secret, secret project. And this is him. Hi. He's got a green Lemieux. Hi. Are you cleaning in there, Gabby? <laughs> She's like, this is a, this a camera a treat. Yeah, there she is. Anyway, this is Gabby's secret project horse today. No, he's not. He's not hers, but it's a secret project we're working on right now. He has all four socks. He has all four socks. What? <laughs> yeah. Hi, Lily. Do you like her? So they're new to this barn, so we're making it extra fun, making the horses <laughs> extra muddy for them. <laughs> I, I need help. Yeah, we don't know, I don't know if this is Sailor. You don't know what, if this is Sailor? Yeah, is this Sailor? Uh, <laughs> I don't know, Elizabeth, you the don't even know your own no, horse. That's what Sophie told me. The I think it is. So you didn't get Buddy? I couldn't catch the We thing. couldn't catch him. He kept running around and she didn't want to step in the mud. So then I had to walk and he kept running away from me. Oh. Where's your rain boots? In the car. Go put them on. Sailor. I'm going to see if this is Sailor. I think it is. <laughs> so you got Buddy? This is not Buddy. This is... Uh, but did you get Buddy? Yeah. yeah. I got did you? Oh, you got it? I'm the horse whisperer today. Oh, you're the horse whisperer today? <laughs> well, let's remember that when you're riding a new horse. Yeah. All right. So, you loved Sailor or you didn't love Sailor? Okay. Like <laughs> There's a story to it. Yeah. I like his canter. I like his trot. His jump. It's not your thing. Kind of. All right, here's some treats for Sailor. He's like, yes, I deserve some treats. So everybody meet Sailor. So what's the plan for next week? I'm riding Buddy. Sophie's gonna ride Sparky. That's what she said. She said she wants to ride Sparky. And then she's gonna ride Buddy the next week and I'm probably gonna ride him or someone else. I don't know. Yeah, try somebody else. Yeah. Sophie and Elizabeth found a compromise so that they can share Buddy because he's the coveted oh. horse right now. Sophie's way down here at the other end of the barn. We got treats for you too, Buddy. Don't you worry. He, he's, getting, he's getting cuter and cuter. <laughs> <laughs> it's freezing. It's so cold. Sophie, Gabby's riding different horses right now, she's trying things out. I put my legs together, my knees hit each other, and it hurts. So she's even going to be riding a different horse next I'm week. I'm riding Finn, Sophia. A Finn. Mm -hmm. a I'm riding horse, Finn. A horse named Finn. Are those crossed? Those don't look like they're crossed. They're not because it shouldn't fit. Here, give him some treats. He already oh. had a little apple. Oh. Were they not crossed when, when they you got them? Cross them. Cross them. Yeah, you gotta cross them. No, you got Gabby. <laughs> Have fun. Oh, I know, I don't know what is wrong with her. Don't you know that you're